Well, here we are with fair trade expert Kim Fitzwarren, who's related to Mr. Fitzwarren, and we're going to answer some questions. So the first question is, what is fair trade? And that comes from Hugo. Well, fair trade is um, a way of selling things. So it could be uh, it could be chocolate, or it could be coffee, or tea. There are lots and lots of different things. Um, where the person who's grown, say let's let's say chocolate. So the the people who've grown the chocolate, the cocoa beans to make the chocolate, they get a, they get all the money for selling for for selling the chocolate comes to them instead of going to a big company in the middle like. Cadbury's or, or Nestle or something like that. So if people grow cocoa pods and sell them to someone like a company like Nestle, for example, then Nestle get most of the money for themselves, whereas with fair trade chocolate, the people who've done all the hard work to grow the cocoa beans, they get the money themselves. So they, they can then send their children to school and then they can have the doctor when they need the doctor Otherwise, they will be too poor to be able to go to school or go to the doctors when they need to. Thank you. And the next question comes from Yona, and it's, do most of the products get made by hand or on machines? Well, it depends what the product is. There are lots and lots of different products. So, um, food things like uh, coffee and tea and chocolate, there have been machines involved in making those but there's also a lot of crafts like pottery and carved wood items and uh, toys that are made by hand so some of those will be made by hand and jewellery too. Okay next question um, how many things can be made in one day? I guess you've answered that already um, in that if whether it's on a machine or by hand that question comes from Javi um, so obviously if it's handmade then it's going to be a slower process yes um, it take a very long time to make to make something like a carved ornament and so that would be a bit be more expensive and the next question comes from Delia um, how is the stuff transported um, say to say to Spain from a country where it's manufactured it would go by aeroplane and by lorry. Right, thank you. Um, two more questions. Um, do you do you use um, lots of fair trade materials and have products in your own house? Um, yes, yes. Mr. Fitzwarren and Mr. Fitzwarren Senior, that is Mr. Fitzwarren's dad and myself, we always buy fair trade stuff when we can. So this, for example, is fair trade washing up liquid. So that means that people have made this washing up liquid and they, and they get the money for making it rather than uh, rather than somebody else, a big company getting them getting the money for making it. Brilliant. And I know that the, the goldfish is quite interested in this. So hello to all the students in Spain from Mrs. Fitzwarren, Mr. Fitzwarren Senior, and Fernando. See you soon.